What is a portfolio? A portfolio is a collection of financial instruments. Your portfolio is a selection of financial instruments in which you have invested your money. By financial instruments we mean various investment options like shares, mutual funds, real estate, banks fixed deposits, and bonds. Let's take an, an example to understand this. Suppose, 5 years back Mr. Amrish made 3 different investments. He put Rs. 20,000 in stocks, Rs. 15,000 in mutual funds and Rs. 10,000 in bank FD. The total initial portfolio value of Mr. Amrish was Rs. 45,000, as represented in the first pie chart below. This total portfolio value is called net worth. Today, the same investments have grown and the value of the stocks that Mr. Amarish bought is Rs. 30,000, value of the mutual funds is Rs. 20,000 and amount in bank FD is Rs. 12,000. So the current total portfolio net worth of Mr. Amarish is Rs. 62,000, as shown in the second pie chart. As you can see in the above pie charts, weight of stocks in Mr. Amarish's portfolio increased from 45% to 49%. Weight of any instrument is current value of the instrument divided by the portfolio net worth. It shows the portion of total net worth represented by a particular instrument. Initially the value of the stocks was Rs 20,000, so the initial weight was 22%. After 5 years, the value of the stocks is Rs 30,000 and total net worth is Rs 62,000. Thus, the current weight is 49%. Instead of investing in different types of financial instruments, one can invest in different financial instruments of the same type. For example, you can buy three different stocks. In this example, the instrument type is equities, shares, for all the investments. Let's take the same example again. This time instead of three different types of instruments, Mr. Amrish bought three different stocks, Reliance, Maruti and SPI. He put Rs 50,000 in Reliance, Rs 20,000 in Maruti and Rs 25,000 in SPI. After 5 years, current value of these investments in Reliance, Maruti and SPI are Rs 35,000, Rs 30,000 and Rs 40,000. These pie charts show what happened with Mr. Amrish's portfolio in last 5 years. By looking at above charts, we can easily conclude that Reliance generated less returns compared to Maruti and SPI, in last 5 years. Calculating a portfolio's return Let's continue with the same example. 5 years back. Mr. Amarish had invested Rs 50,000 in Reliance, Rs 20,000 in Maruti and Rs 25,000 in SPI. The current values of these investments in Reliance, Maruti and SPI are Rs 35,000, Rs 30,000 and Rs 40,000, respectively. Thus, the total portfolio net worth changed from Rs 95,000 to Rs 1,5,000. The total cumulative value of Mr. Amrish's investment increased by Rs 10,000 in last 5 years. We define net worth as the sum of values of all the investments. We can also define it as the amount that Mr. Amrish will receive, if he wants to liquidate his investments. Suppose, today Mr. Amrish wants to take out all his money. He can sell shares of Reliance and get Rs 35,000. Similarly, he can get Rs 30,000 and Rs 40,000, by selling all the shares of Maruti and SPI, respectively. The total money that he can generate by selling all his investments is Rs 1,5,000 which is equal to the portfolio net worth. We can say that Mr. Amarish will receive additional Rs 10,000 on his investment of Rs 95,000, if he decides to liquidate all investments. Thus, the current return generated by his portfolio is 10.53% or in other words, he can receive a return of 10.53% if he sells off everything and liquidate his portfolio today. You can calculate your portfolio with the equation. Portfolio return equals current net worth minus initial net worth divided by initial net worth. Thanks for watching Indian Stock Hunter. Please subscribe and stay tuned for more valuable contents.